Hey everybody, Chance Priest, Priest Toy Safari, episode 24. I went in there and checked, it's 24. Uh, so, again, if you want to go and become a YouTube subscriber, which I'm just starting, we're just trying to do that, uh, it's Victory Comics LLC, or you can just check out Priest Toy Safari. I think that'll lead you there. Uh, the toys that we make, that noise is my dog Mars. You know he's trouble. Uh, <laughs> uh, the uh, the toys that we make, Victory Comics LLC, on Instagram, and um, and in fact, coming up, in fact, this weekend I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna have a giveaway where if you, uh, well, we'll get it all. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick a pretty darn good toy to give away, so everybody goes and joins me and, and does all that stuff. I drink some water now, it's on my lip. But anyway, um, and if you're not part of the Facebook group priests monsters aliens and superheroes join up because man I do lots of these videos on all this other stuff and um, I get busy sometimes and don't do them regular but but uh then like really cold nights it's Friday night I got nothing to do I, I might do two or three so anyway anyway got some really good uh, vintage kaiju stuff uh, so foobie you know what I, I think this box I think is a mix so it's like some vintage some you know, not vintage, but it's super cool. I mean, like, really cool stuff. So, anyway, I just started off and just kill it. Look at that. Boom! Original. Uh, original blow mold of, of Giant Robot. He didn't got no Johnny Sacco, but that's him. That's the, that's the 1960s one, blow mold. Really, really hard to find. These are really torn up. They have holes in them and cracks in them all the time. And lots of uh, marker. But not this one. I don't think. Nope. This one's nice. I mean, you know, it's used. It's loved, but pretty. That's what I like. Loved and pretty. Um, here is a um, original. God, these are like, that's like 14 inches, I guess. I think Masadaya or uh, like I can read Japanese, but anyway, he's an original talking giant. Uh, uh, Mirror Man, thank you. So, who, man? So he talks good. It's just in Japanese, as you'd expect. But uh, anyway, hey, that's really cool. Mm. Uh, I'm just gonna go through every one of these bags because I don't really know what's in here. I just give it a look. Look, here is a I don't know what that's like a Garamon. I don't know. He's a he's a Bandai guy. But if you collect Bandai and you like pretty Garamons, that's a good one. Uh, as usual, trades sales wide open, man. I'm an open book. Just holler at me, and please make comments on stuff, y'all. And oh, and if it seems like I'm rude or something, I joke around all the time. You, 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 I'm not, I, you can't make me mad. I've been through everything. I don't get mad. I can get, I can get mad. I mean, but usually it's got to be in person. I can't get mad over somebody over the dang computer. <laughs> anyway, check that out. Uh, that's an old blow mold knockoff Spectre Man. He's dead mint. Probably come out of a bag or something. Look at there, he's got his, anyway, he's mint. He's awesome. Um, Oh, look here. I think I got a little, uh, that's a marmot, uh, Godzilla. And I think I got a little, like, a Hedra, you know, where he's flying back, doing the whole, you know, kick Hedra's butt deal, you know? So, I don't know, I love Hedra. I hate to see him get his butt kicked. Uh, there's an original old, um, wow, uh, uh, speaking, you know, everybody always asks me why I always do that. You know, that's my sign. Not, not like that. That's peace, right? The hippie started that. This is victory. Okay, this was the most common hand sign ever used from about 1938 to 1945. That's what everybody did. 46, they used it afterwards. That's victory. Victory over fascism and communism and all that other isms. That we don't want no part of. Boom. So anyway, that's what that is when you see me. Boom. And a victory comics. You know, so that's that's our sign. Boom. Victory. 
So there is a cool little uh, Red Baron. He's um, Y. Uh, I go through this every time that Y pops up. I know it. I can't think of it. Anyway, he's got some riding on his back. So he's cheap, right? But he looks good. Looks good up front. Actually, actually, you know a smart thing to do? And I thought of this the other day. I have one that's got a lot of... Uh, that, I don't know what happened. It, it's a, a big Ella King. That somebody took a marker and like put marker all over him. Just airbrush. Airbrush on top of him. Easy. You got a killer vintage figure. Got a killer... Do a killer paint job on it. Heck, make it worth more. These are awesome. That's a... Uh, you know, I hit the start on some music... And I think that's Forrest Ackerman just talking. So anyway. Um, oh my god. Anyway, uh, so there's a uh, there's a uh, uh, 1960s Soaky bubble bath container for you youngsters. Uh, and uh, really nice Wolfman. Wolfman's always a toughie to find. He just has to be down that box. Uh, this is, uh, what are those guys called? King. Whatever. I can't remember. Y'all know. Anyway. King. He's got a helmet. Um, my brain, man. My brain, it's gone. There you go. There's there's another one. Uh, another one of them. Hinch and Cyborg. But they're, these are the vinyl ones. And these are the ones, I think they made these like in the 90s sometime. I think, I think I've had that set since the 90s sometime. King, King something. There's a helmet. Yeah, there we go. There we go. What's up? Check it out. See? Like a bug robot man. Cool though. Super cool. I think there's three of them in there somewhere. That is beautiful. It's like a dead mint soaky of... Creature from Black Lagoon. Oh, those are ridiculous cool. I had so much of this stuff up on my shelf. I mean, my shelves, my whole house was just covered in it, man. So pretty, you know? So cool. Stunning. Gotta get back to those times. I see another one. But this is pretty fun going through these deals on videos. At least I'll know where everything's at when I go to put it out. Well, his, uh, no big deal. His leg, leg popped out. It's not hurt or nothing. It just popped out. But anyway, that's the coolest one. You know, he's, of course, ah, he's a skull guy, right? And he's got some guts going on on the inside, you can see. But anyway, ta Takara. Hinch and Cyborg. Hinch and, oh, I think I forgot to set my dang timer. I'm supposed to be timing these things, y'all. Yes, I forgot. Okay, just do it. Anyway, I can't remember nothing. Oh. Too many kicks in the head. Um, anyway, this is so awesome. It's Bear Model. And it's Bear Model is like one of my favorite companies. I, I just love them. They, they have their own style of doing all these guys. It's so good, you know. Anyway, there's a Bear Model Spectre Man with pipe cleaners, which it ain't much, right? Just sticking some pipe cleaners in something. But, man, it turns me on. I love pipe cleaners and glitter and stuff because that's just... That's just added coolness, you know, just, you know, just more icing on the cake. Put a little ice on the toy cake. Love it. Anyway, there is a, see, I told y'all this is partial vintage, partial new. I don't remember who made that guy. That's a pretty cool glow in the dark. Um, I, I, I'm really kind of at a loss on that one. Uh, uh, look here. I brought my old man glasses. Uh. First time I ever remember my glasses. And I still, don't matter. I can't read Japanese, so it don't do me no good. Anyway, um, so, I don't know. Is that, it's an odd size, too, man. He's like seven inches tall. So, anyway, but he's glowing in the dark. He's really awesome. And he's a uh, mirror man. Let's see here. We got a Marmot 2004 Alien whatever, right? There's a million of them. I can't remember. But anyway, pretty darn cool. Look at that shirt and everything. Boots. Got those old 70s disco boots. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Oh, hey, I got another one of these. Um, I guess there's four of these guys. 
This one is the best. Forget the skull guy. This is Plant Man. I don't know what it is about like... I guess it's from Thing from Another World, but when you put plant into into um, you know like a human or whatever and like it's a creature and it's half plant you know like Biollante you know like half plant half monster I, uh, yes I'm a genius so cool man it's so cool look at there sprays sprays something or pops out seeds or something I can't remember and he's got guts these all need to be kind of put back together oh they've been in this tub forever they're mint you know just run a hair dryer Pop them out, no big deal. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, here is a little Godzilla. Everybody love a Godzilla. Bandai, I'm sure. Back to the old man glasses. Yutaka, maybe? Yamakatsu. Yutaka, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, there he is. Uh... Oh, it's pretty rare. It's uh, like a Bullmark little mini um, 01, right? Um, Kickator 01 robot. I think that's it. Anyway. No, 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 no. Oh, wow. This is good. Or good or cool or whatever you want to call it. And, of course, it's Getter. Getter. Getter robot. But he's vinyl. It's an oldie, man. It's it's the early, you know, the sev late seventies original. It's uh, awesome. Got that. Uh, got that. It's like super hard to find on these. But anyway, if y'all like the Shogun Warrior robots, I do. I mean, I like everything though. You know, when I try to narrow it down, I, it actually gets bigger on me. You know, it's like try to try to sh shave some off, and I, I'm piling more on so i was sitting there I, 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 was, I was like you know how you talk to yourself uh, i mean maybe just i'm crazy anyway but i was talking to myself in here and i was like um i was like what do i like better the big old jumbo vinyls or or the little small ones you know the little two and three inch i was like oh yeah definitely the two I was like, no nah. that grabbed the jumbo i was like nah it's like the jumbos right and, and then i was like having a debate with myself so anyway I don't know. I think people are crazy that don't talk to themselves, personally. Anyway, this is really cool. This is a blow mold. Uh, these are those, um, um, they call them water cans, you know? So, not exactly sure how you suck the water out of there, but anyway, it's a, you play with it, put water in it. You know, like a canteen for over in Japan for little kids to play with. So you go out and make sure you got some water. Yeah. Anyway, uh, oh, but anyway, that's uh, Accumizer, guys. Oh, check it out. This is awesome. Accumizer, vinyl. This is an old one. Um, got it sword. Wow. Is that special or what? It's weird. Is it really done fit in there? Really good? Or really at all? But anyway, there's a sword, and there's the, he's got the hanger, and we don't want to mess nothing up. You know how it is? Oh, it goes in there. That is awesome. He's awesome. The artwork on these guys are so awesome. Like all the package, like all their model kits and stuff. I have a bunch of old model kits. Really cool. Really cool. And now these are good. Everybody. Oh well. Here's something else before I get to this. This is heavy. What we got here? Let's see. Japan. Uh. 1984 Bandai Japan. Look at that. That's that Evolution, whatever. Baltan, uh, Zeton. Yeah, heavy duty figure. Awesome figure, though. I mean, that is an awesome figure. Don't see that. I mean, I just don't even hardly. Actually, when I pull it out, I don't really remember it that well. But anyway, you know what I mean. Uh, now, these are really cool. This is like a set. And I don't know if it came in a box or how it came, but anyway, this is uh, Ultraman, one of them. I can't remember all those dang Ultraman names. 
but it's weird because it's kind of like a hard plastic, but it's kind of like blow mold hard plastic. And it's got a, a, a battery where he, he talks or lots, or I guess he lots up and talks. And of course the battery's not either not working or not in there. God, pray it's not in there and rusted. No, I took them out. Thank God. Anyway, but I remember they worked and they're, they're older uh, knockoffs. These are knockoffs. They come out of China. Long time ago, y'all. I was buying this stuff, you know, 15 years ago. So, oh, look at that. Ultraman Taro. Yeah, they even got like plastic, like little sh deals of plastic. I got, they came around over. I mean, I probably had them on the shelf for a little while, but anyway, they're cool. There's two more, and then we'll get to something else. So, oh yeah, check it out. Oh my God. That, now see, that'd be hard for me to trade that, but look at that, that ball tan. That's nuts. That's a heart starter, man. That's a, that's a freaking shot of adrenaline right there. Whew. That is awesome. Look at that mother. Anyway, real lightweight, but you but but you know heavy duty. I mean, it's like they screwed everything together. I don't know how they made them, but anyway, it's but they're all electronic and you know all uh, take like a little. 3A batteries or something. And then one more, and it's that killer Zeton again. Man, look at that dude. Ridiculous. Awesome. God, I, there's like part of me. Look, the, even the sprue from the plastic is still on there. That's nothing, you know. Anyway, uh, so it di didn't get, you know. In other words, they were pumping these out on the cheap. But they sure are. That's some quality feel to them, man. They look... They're nice. Anyway, I really like those. Okay, yo, man, I'm knocking these suckers out. I'm showing y'all some stuff tonight. Anyway, I've got another deal of, like, some kaiju, some, like, just cool stuff. I'm going to do that. Then I'm going to do one priest toy masterpiece deal. And then, uh, and that's going to be it for the night. Okay, thanks. See you in a few.